Jupiter is considered the great benefic. He brings growth and expansion, and this can be particularly positive when it comes to money and fortune. But when it comes to medical astrology, we tend to keep an eye on whatever zodiac sign Jupiter is transiting. Jupiter is currently transiting the sign of Taurus and will continue to transit that hardy Earth sign until May 25th of 2024, making his stay in Taurus even more intense is the fact that Jupiter is retrograde in Taurus from September 3rd of 23 until December 30th of 23. Since Taurus is a fixed sign, all of the fixed signs will feel this retrograde fairly strongly. The fixed signs are Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, and Aquarius. So if you have a rising sun or moon sign in one of those four fixed signs, this will affect you more strongly. Jupiter, medically speaking, is fattening and oily. He is warm and moist by nature and can be diffusive. The body zones he inhabits during a transit can lead to fatty deposits, tumors, or overgrowth, especially if a person's chart is predisposed. Tumors are often benign with Jupiter, but not always. Jupiter cold rules the liver with Virgo and circulation with Sagittarius. He rules fats and blood. Jupiter can be associated with stroke, aneurysm, weight gain, cholesterol, organ enlargement, pituitary issues, and diabetic liver problems. If we take the microscope off of Jupiter for a minute and look at Taurus, Taurus rules the body zones of the lower head and neck. Essentially, the lower jaw, lower teeth, the cervical vertebrae, the cerebellum, the chin, taste buds, vocal cords, tonsils, upper portion of the esophagus, carotid arteries, ears, and the salivary glands. Think in terms of combining the enlarging effects of Jupiter with those body parts. For instance, we know that Jupiter makes for growth. He rules blood and is fattening. We just learned that Taurus rules the carotid arteries. So as a preventative measure, if you are predisposed to issues with your carotid arteries and Jupiter is in Taurus until May of 2024, you now have the heads up to schedule a follow-up with your cardiologist. And perhaps you are also holistically inclined. If you were, you could speak to your certified herbalist about butcher's broom or perhaps another herbal combination to clean out your arteries. This is a preventative gold mine. Let's take another example. Let's say you're struggling with weight and cholesterol issues. This makes total sense since Jupiter enlarges and rules the blood and can naturally increase cholesterol. Taurus rules the mouth. Appetites will be bigger with Jupiter in Taurus. Your physician may put you on a statin to get the cholesterol down, or your herbalist may suggest encapsulated red yeast to get the cholesterol down without side effects. You gotta love that. You have choices. This is a small example of what medical astrology can do for you. If I were analyzing your chart, I'd look to see what gem remedies could assist 
your natal and transiting chart to empower you and to basically forewarn of potential issues. I'm Cindy Summer and I'm a medical astrologer and I'm a spiritual counselor. For more on my readings, take a look at my website, cindysummer.com, where you can book any readings, see my schedule. Please also consider subscribing, liking, and sharing my YouTube videos. It really helps to spread the word when it comes to empowering. And don't forget to hit that bell for notifications.